everybody. Good morning. It is uh, a beautiful Wednesday here in Rosary Beach, Mexico, and I'm on the phone talking with Craig Klein from the Rosary Living Facebook group, and we're doing our weekly promotions for the events in Rosary Beach. Good morning, Craig. Hey, good morning, Canola. Craig, I, I guess before we get started talking about the events, I want to let you know we've been looking through some of the stats on the website, and the website's only a few months old right now, and since we've been working with you on the events, we've been able to get thousands of people to see the local events on the website, and I know you're getting a ton of people to see them on the Facebook group, but even some of uh, the some of our top numbers are up in the, about 4,000, averaging about two to 4,000 page views on the events, which... For a brand new website, I think it's uh, it's uh, some good numbers, and I think they're just going to get bigger as the site becomes more of an authority um, regarding Rosary Beach. So we're excited to see that we're able to drive all this traffic to the local events. Well, wow, that's what it's all about. A lot of the events uh, are tied to charities, uh, fundraisers, and sponsorships, and stuff like that. And then the ones that aren't always have uh, performers that are, you know, struggling artists. They're trying to get, uh, you know, their career going and. You know, they don't make a whole lot of money down here at their gigs, so it's great to get the crowds to show up and put a little money in the tip jars. And uh, a lot of people down here work for tips, so tips are always important. I want to remind people, you know, we you do this for free. I mean, you don't get paid for this, and, and we're doing the promotions on Rosary Living uh, for them for free. And just because it's free doesn't mean there's no value in it. We, you know, I think that, you know, the the, the what we're offering – to the uh, to the local community is something that's really uh, valuable, and we and and just because it's free, don't discount it. So please, you know, make sure to get your events into Rosary Living, the Facebook group, and to the RosaryLiving.com website to get the uh, to get to get just more people to see what's going on. Yes, and I've been talking to some of the people that have been doing the uh, the free interviews with you uh, Fridays from noon to two o'clock, or is it ten to noon? Uh, that yeah, uh, to noon. they can go in and get a ha- so. ten to noon on Fridays. They can get a free half hour commercial basically uh, do an interview with you which you'll post on the website to promote their business or their charity their cause whatever it is which some of those of the views have been in the thousands so i'm really happy to see um you know those working out too so i think you know between uh, everything that we're doing right now for, at least for the online world we're able to direct a lot of people to see some of the best stuff that's happening here in rosary beach sounds great so let's get started what's going on this week uh, well, obviously, it's uh, Semana Santa, Holy Week, and uh, so the crowds are in town, even though it's uh, the weather's not the best today. It should be a good week, and uh, the weekend, so the beach will be crowded, the streets will be full, the bars and restaurants, so uh, be careful driving out there, make your reservations if you're going for dinner. But uh, starting on Thursday, uh, we got Frau, the Foreign Residence Assistance Office, has their monthly meeting, so it's on the third Thursday, and that'll be at 10 o'clock in the morning in the Titanic Room down at Columbia. Mafia Resort, and then on Friday, uh, local duo His and Hers is playing in a new venue, their first time down in La Mission at Del Valle Cafe, that'll be Friday from 5 to 8, uh, a lot of us were all down there last uh, Saturday for second Saturday, but uh, this will be their first time, if you've never heard them, they are definitely worth a, a shot to go see. On Saturday, we got four big events, uh, USBC, the United Society of Baja California, has their monthly potluck, always on the third Saturday. That'll be at 1 o'clock at La Maroma. And this is a special one. Uh, it's an Easter version. Obviously, it's Easter weekend. And uh, the hostess, Dorothy Southern, is inviting everybody to attend. You don't need to be a member. It's a potluck, so bring a dish. Or if you have no cooking facilities or can't stop anywhere, you can pay $5 uh, to attend. And it's going to be a special Price is Right and... Uh, kind of a game show type thing. Uh, it's always good food, good people. USBC is an umbrella organization that supports lots of charities and causes and groups around town. And this is one of their, uh, their best social activities they have every month. Also on Saturday and Sunday is the Bazaar Artesano, which will be at the Festival Plaza Hotel. It's both days, 8 to 8. So if you want to do some shopping for some local artwork or crafts, that's a great place to go. It'll be on the streets right there next to Festival Plaza. Also on Saturday from 4 to 6, there's going to be a paint and wine workshop for $30 at Popotla, which is a trailer park just a little bit south of town. There's a big, beautiful restaurant in there. And then also at uh, 5 o'clock on Saturday is a big fundraiser for pretty horses called La Noche del Caballo, the night of the horse. And that will be in the ranch just up uh from Puerto Nuevo, basically, in the hills. 
On Sunday, we got the Blues Against Hunger Society has their third out of 17 consecutive Sundays, and that'll be uh, free to attend, but the only thing asked for is a food donation, which is collected by Hearts of Baja to provide food for the orphanages throughout the year. The goal this year is 8,000 pounds, so that's about uh, a little over 400 pounds needed each week. So bring your bags of rice or beans or whatever you can, canned goods, to donate there. Also, that same day at Bully's Bar up in Baja Malibu, they're having an adult egg hunt with adult prizes, alcohol-related, some kind of other type things. It'll let your mind figure that out. So that'll be at 2 o'clock on Sunday at Bully's Bar. And then also that same day, out at uh, Pretty Horses Ranch again, is a birthday party for Sasha Valencia. That's from 4 to 8. And on Tuesday at Mongolian Grill is going to be a keto challenge for anybody that's doing the keto diet or is interested in uh, finding out more about that or just having fun with some people. You can show up at Mongolian Grill on Popola Boulevard on Tuesdays. And all the details for these events are in the uh, Rosarito Town Choir email blast. You can find it on the blog at rosaritoliving.com. We also have, uh, as a bonus, a couple things on Wednesday. Chuy Gomez will start being at Bobby's by the Sea now, and Austin Graham uh, performs down at Del Valle at kilometer 62.5. So that's uh, a couple things to get you through the end of the week until uh, next Thursday when I give the new report. Well, have fun, everybody. Okay, well, thank you very much, Craig. I think there's a lot going on. We encourage everyone to participate, get involved, have fun, stay safe, and until next week, we'll talk to everyone later. Have a great day, everybody.